Mari. Good evening. Sukumar Surya. Good evening. Kritika Kirti. Good evening. Smati Dasan. Good evening. Rasim. Good evening. Okay. Shall we start now? So today we are going to uh, see looping statements. Okay. statement before that uh, yesterday i gave uh, an assignment uh, regarding weekdays using a uh, switch case statement display weekdays using switch case statement uh, so so many of you uh, are done and uh, you sent me already through my whatsapp number um, suguma surya yesterday uh, he sent um, WhatsApp. He sent uh, the program to WhatsApp and Kritika Kirti and uh, she also sent and Rasina Sifana she sent and uh, Smafi Blas Marita she also sent and uh, Magesh Prabhu yesterday he sent. So uh, thank you. Thank you and uh, I appreciate all. I appreciate your work. And all you have uh, done very well the uh, work today. Okay, fine. Uh, Nanda Kumar, a new arrival. Hi, sir. Hi, Nanda Kumar. And then Magesh Prabhu came late. Hi. Fine. We are going to see looping statements. Looping statements, what is the purpose of looping statements? Before that, before going to uh, syntax and what are the looping statements available in uh, um, programming language, before we uh, we are going to discuss what is the purpose of uh, we need to say we need to uh, study what is the purpose of looping statement. There are uh, so many uh, things we uh, there are so many applications we are seeing in real world. For example. Uh, you, you can see in the mobile, in the basic set, basic set mobiles, some of your mobile has lots of screen saver, you know that. Okay. Moreover, our Windows, whoever is using Windows operating system, whoever is using a desktop, uh, the desktop having some, uh, what, that is screen saver. Each and every screen saver, it will be routinely uh, same action will be routinely uh, uh, for example if you are using windows xp operating system means windows xp logo it will be uh, displayed here in the screen and then it will become here and then it will become here and then it, it will become here like that the same action again finally it will be start from this position and end up this position so, a same action will repeatedly doing means we have to use looping statements. Wherever we need a same action routinely this working means we have to use looping statements. That is the necessity of using looping statements. Number one. Number two. Uh, you can see the uh, news headlines, you know. Uh, whatever uh, it may be, whatever channel it may be. It may be a uh, or it may be a news uh, 7 channel or news 8 or sun news or connected news whatever so each and every tv channels a routine uh, set of news it will be displayed under or above it will be coming again and again once it will be reached a set of uh, a set of news it will be over first it will be start again from first and it will be come in for example a news channel consists of 20 headlines means first headline it will be go and then second and then third after completion of 20 it will become from start so here what are the things we, we are seeing that is initialization that is starting stage initialization that is starting point of the thing number two 
what is the ending stage? If we are having 20 sets of news, 20 of news means uh, that is the 20 is the last state. So that is end state. Initialization and end state. If first news is completed, means you have to use next, 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 like that. So each and every news it will be incrementing again and, and incrementing by 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. If first news completely over means it will display the second news and then third news and then fourth and then fifth and then sixth like that. So the third part is increment and then finally we have to give a what type of what we are going to display that is news right so that we are going to see the statement. So these are all the important terms of looping statements. This is called condition back to end. Okay. So these are the four things we are going to see in the looping statements. These are the steps of looping statements. So steps of looping statements. Sets of looping statements. So how the visibility, Sugma Surya, poor visibility you told, how about uh, visibility now? What are others? Rasina, Nandakumar, Nagesh Prabhu, and then Kritika Kriti, Jagani Mani. What about others? And Smurfy Blossom. What about yours quality? How uh, the display is? Okay, fine, right? What about Sugma Surya? So, you are okay, fine. I am just starting. Uh, these are the steps of looping statement initials, initialization, and then condition, and then increment, and then statement. So, statement it will become in the third, and uh, increment or decrement it will become in fourth. So, uh, these are the steps for all the looping statements. All the looping statements that will be work like that only initialization condition and then statement or type of statement and increment decrement i already told you the news for the example for example what we are going to display that is news what we are going to display set of news and uh, what is the increment or decrement means i mean uh, that is promotion what is the increment and decrement means First news it will be displayed and then second news and then third news up to it will be go 20. If any news is fake or any news is outdated means we have to omit the news. So based on the increment it will be. It may be a 1, 3, 5, 7, 8 like that or it may be 20, 18 or 16 like that. It may be increment or decrement. What way it may be, it, it, it will, it will, uh, uh, it will proceed. And then condition is, what is the end? Starting news is first news and then ending news is 20th news. So like that it will be go. So, uh, and uh, in the screen saver example, if Windows XP it will be uh, displaying here means the ending place is here. So now it is uh, initialization and it is called ending or it is a condition or it is the limit of the looping statements. Okay. So now
Okay, so we go to the programming. So these are the uh, steps for looping statements, initialization, condition, and then statement, and then increment, decrement. Like that, you just note it down. So now we are going to see the examples for looping statements. Now, what are the various looping statements available in C, C++, and Java? What are the various looping statements are available? There are three statements are available. Number one is for loop. For loop. Number two, that is while loop. Number three is do while loop. Just note it down. These are the types of loops. Just for two minutes and note it down. This one. Statements. A single statement or 
block of state. You got it there? So what are the, uh, what are the things we have to uh, see here? For, for is a keyword and then what is the initial stage we have to mention here after the semicolon and then condition and then here we have to do increment or decrement. If we are seeing one example means we can easily get the idea about for. Just note it down. Noted means I will go through the example. program so what uh, is the problem definition is we are going to uh, we are going to print 1 2 3 4 5 up to 10 numbers we are going to uh, print the output will be like that 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 so this is a problem we are going to uh, we are going to write a program for displaying these numbers first C programming. So I am just starting from uh, ash include include stdio dot h and then void main here we are going to mention a variable we are going to print 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 up to 10 so that all the numbers are integer numbers so that I am just using integer n i i integer i I am going to use for I am not going to get any I am not going to get any input because I am going to print 1 to 10 numbers so that I am just starting from 1 what is the syntax of for? For loop. What, what is the syntax of for loop? That is initialization. That is the starting stage. What is the starting stage here? Number one. So that i is equal to one. Semicolon. What is the condition? I less less than or equal to ten. We already saw the. We already saw the operator that is called less than or equal to and then what is the next it is starting from 1 and it is ending up to 10 this is the meaning of it is starting from 1 it is, it is ending up to 10 why we are used less than or equal to Plus 
so we started initialization and we uh, see the condition and increment decrement you got it so finally what we are going to print here print f print f we are going to uh, print an integer number that is called we are going to print integer num number that's why we are using percentage d and then we are going to print i and then you just close the program i am just explaining this program you just see explain it explanation of this one explanation see here how it will be working so it is coming here so uh, after that we mentioned what the i value is i value is 1 i value is 1 after that what is the next thing i less than or equal to 10 1 equal to 10 1 less than or equal to 10 condition true or false 1 is less than or equal to 10 which condition is true 1 is less than that is true so the condition is true first this will be work and then condition it will be work and then statement it will be work after the execution of the statement the increment or decrement it will be work starting procedure itself I told initialization condition state statement and increment decrement like that it will be work so i is equal to 1 number 1 number 2 i less than or equal to 10 condition is true what should do the third one is we need to print the integer number that is 1 it will be it will be printed and then i is equal to i plus 1 i is equal to i plus 1 means what is the i value here that is 1 1 plus 1 that is i value is 2 i value is 2 2 means 2 less than or equal to 10 2 less than or equal to 10 whether the con condition is true or false the condition is true true means what to do we need to print an integer number the integer number is i so i value it should be printed 2 it will be printed and we need to increment the value by 1 so i is equal to i plus 1 2 plus 1 that is 3 the second one, first time alone initialization it will be work. Second time condition, statement, increment, decrement. Condition, statement, inc increment, decrement. Condition, statement, increment, decrement. Like so the condition is 3 less than or equal to 10. The con condition is true. So that we need to increment the value of 3 plus 1 is equal to 4. Likewise, it will be go when it is coming reach to 10, 10, 10, less than or equal to 10, 10 less than 10, the condition is true, the condition is false, 10 is not less than 10, 10 is equal to 10, so we need to, we have two options, one is less and another one is equal to, so the Second condition is satisfying because we are seeing less than or equal to. Either one should be true. So equal is true. The 10 is equal to true. The condition is true. Then it will be work. What? It will become 10. Up to 10 it will be printed. And after the, the 10 it will be incremented by 1. The value is 11. When it is coming end, 11 less than or equal to. Then either the condition is false or not, the condition is false, less 10, 11 less than or equal to 10, the condition is false, so it will be terminated, so it, it will be terminated, that's it.
ஓகேண்ணா okay is it okay now so now uh, we are going to uh, see 1 2 3 4 5 how uh, we are going to see up to 100 what to do now for uh, 100 i is equal to 1 i less than or equal to 10 in the case of uh, in the case of 10 we have to uh, change up to 100 that's simple so you just make it as 100 and then i plus plus the same thing it will become okay for example if you are uh, if you need to uh, apply if you are going to get any value ninga vandu or 15 abinu sonna 15 varai print aagum 25 nu sonna 25 varai print aagum enna number kudukuramo what number we are going to give here it should be print as it is now vandu compare pannum bodhe decide டிசைன் பண்ண கூடாது அதுக்கு முன்னாடியே நாம டிசைன் பண்ணி வைக்கணும் அப்படி நாம நினைச்சா நாம கரெக்ட்டா இப்போ 100 னு கொடுக்குறோம் 100 தான் பிரிண்ட் ஆகும் ஏ 100 தான் வருமா வேற எதுவும் வராதா அப்படிங்க கேஸ்க்கு யூ ஹேவ் டு கிவ் n அப்படி மென்ஷன் பண்ணனும் சோ வாட் वी ஹேவ் டு டிசைட் ஹியர் n சோ நவ வாட் இஸ் n அந்த n தான் யாரன்னு சொல்லணும் அப்படினா n அப்படிங்கிறது இன்டிஜர் நம்பர் n அப்படிங்கறது இன்டிஜர் நம்பர் அப்படி சொல்றோம் சோ தென் we have to get the limit for that first is எழுதி போ அதுக்கு அப்புறம் that thing we will see so up to uh, 100 we just make it like that so how we are going to convert uh, into a c++ program the same thing you are going to do here that is c out i the simple thing you have to do a simple uh, change in the program i o string dot pitch so how we are going to uh, do in the java and just rubbing here import import java dot i o dot star and then you are going to do import java dot util dot star and then you are going to see what you are going to uh, you want to create a class right so how to create a class class loop demo both are same word you can give anything so loop demo both are same word there is no gap in between loop and demo so in this case you have to give public static void main and then inside the bracket string and then args okay so what we have to write here integer i so we don't want to use scanner here because we are not going to get any value so that we have to write here what the same explanation for this uh, program so what we have to do for i is equal to 1 i less than or equal to 100 and then i plus plus or i is equal to i plus 1 so inside the for loop we have to write system dot out dot print ln what we have to write i value we should print it we need to close the main and we need to close the class so this is a simple example for 1 200 numbers the heading of the program is print display 1 200 numbers using for loop just note it down and we will see in the next thing we are going to see we will see, um allow the limit kudut idu nama kudutra limit allow the at the time of compilation enna nama kudukromo andha mari display aagum nama vandu paakanum adu rendavathu paakalam 
இதை ஜஸ்ட் நோட் மட்டும் படிக்கோங்க அடுத்தது அதை நான் வந்து ஜாவலே போட்டு காட்டிடுவோம் அதுக்கப்புறம் அந்த ப்ரோக்ராம் நீங்க சீரையும் சி பிளஸ் பிளஸ்லையும் நீங்க பண்ண போறீங்க
limit enter limit two. so if you are giving a uh, hundred means it will be display one two three four five six seven eight nine ten up to hundred if you are giving if you are giving a uh, one two minus ten means it will not display anything because the condition itself false if the condition is true the statement will be executed how the if we are giving minus 10 for n how it will be displayed it will not display why it will not display i i is 1 less than or equal to minus either it is true or false less than or equal to minus 10 means that is false so there is nothing it will be displayed Based on the condition only it will be displayed. How many times this is it will be determined? How many times which one it will be determined? Based on the condition only it will be determined. If you are giving n other minus 10, 0 times it will be executed because it, the condition is itself false. So that's why we have the, the loop it will not work. If you are giving my 100 means it will be uh, displayed up to 100 times. It will be displayed up to 100 times the loop will be work. Loop means the same work will be done. You got it that? So the work is, these are the work for you. Uh, what is the work? You have to, I uh, wrote the Java program. You have to get the n value. How you are going to uh, get from the C programming? Print of, enter the limit. Scan of, percentage D, address of n. The same thing, the thing you are going to change. After that, you have to print C, uh, uh, I mean, print of percentage D N. This is a case of C programming. In the C++ programming, what you are going to do? C out, enter the limit. And then C in N value. And then C out, I value you are going to print. Okay. So, this is the two works for you. And then moreover, the work is that, so how you are how you are going to see uh, your how you are going to display odd numbers and even numbers? You have to print one, three, five, seven up to ninety nine. How you are going to display? How will it be displayed? Based on the increment, it will be one. Only the problem when the increment of no be increment of matter no i is equal to i plus one in the number i is equal to, instead of i is equal to i plus 1 you have to give i is equal to i plus 2 above first one and display on the top row increment layer, i is equal to i plus 1 it will be that means i plus 2 is what 1 plus 2 is 3 3 plus 2 is 5 5 plus 2 is 7 it will become up to 99 what is the limit you have to give 99 or 100 100 could have 100 display of all the length. But anyway, up to 99 it will be displayed. You got it that? So, this is a problem you have to give without the limit. Now, limit could have given. And I think you could have given the first program. Now, the grand program could have given the first program. You are going to give, you are going to display, you are going to, display, you are going to write a program for this even number, this odd number. And then even number. Even number to the other panaboring. You know what I'm going to say? Chinna change initialization is zero to the boring. Zero to the two. Condition and amana go to the room. Increment are there. I is equal to I plus two. Zero, two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve, fourteen, up to hundred. So now you will work on the end of dinner. Moon C pro and C programming. Yes, the law. C programming for this one. Move C programming. C programming for this problem and uh, this odd number problem and even number problem. Move C programming in here. C plus plus will give you in the program one, odd number one, and then even number. And uh, Java, other thing here, what is the render? And the whole Java program now for the time you are going to uh, do for. Numbers. Uh, programming, C plus plus programming, Java. Okay? Now, I want to work Yet the program work with the Naki Arma, Panilo, Ademazin, Nala Panilan, Naki Panama on the 
ஐ மீன் நேற்று ப்ரோக்ராம் எழுதி எனக்கு வந்து வாட்ஸ்அப்பில் அனுப்பிச்சவங்க வந்து கிருத்திகா கீர்த்தி சுகுமார் சூர்யா ஹரிதா அண்ட் நகேஷ் பிரபு அண்ட் ஐ எம் எக்ஸ்பெக்டிங் மோர் மோர் அண்ட் மோர் நீங்கள் கொடுங்க நேற்று நான் நிறைய பேருக்கு கரெக்ஷன் பண்ணி அனுப்பிச்சிருந்தேன் வாட்ஸ்அப்லேயே வந்து கரெக்ஷன் பண்ணி அனுப்பிச்சிருந்தேன் ஸோ யூ ஜஸ்ட் டூ உட் நீங்கள் ப்ரோக்ராம் எழுத எழுத த ப்ரோக்ராமிங் ரைட்டிங் ப்ரோக்ராம் ஸ்கில்ஸ் இட் வில் பி டிஸ்பிக் இட் வில் பி டெவலப் when you are going to when you are for our, for interview interview ninga interview panel ku poringa or sequence thara in the sequence ku ninga c programming nu in the program ku in the sequence ku ninga c plus plus program eduthu na adu solikkala sequence 1 3 5 7 9 11 11 i gave the sequence what i told you just write the program for the sequence so like that they will give a situation at the time and they will give you a notepad and pen at the time spontaneously you have to uh, at the spot you have to write the uh, program and you have to give the hr so based on the writing skills only you will be a you will be selected in in the in your interview in the you can uh, work in the software company okay so try it and write more programs um execution avada edu better appadina writing the program da vandu romba better a irukum adanalada namale vandu writing uh, uh, basics uh, writing programs basics nu namu undu aarambichu kittadala idu oru 10 naal class mudichirukku and uh, over naal daily pudus pudusa nadaiyala vandu da irukkeenga and uh, innum ungalude friends ku vandu neenga eduthu solunga friends ku vandu eduthu solradhan moolama kandipa avangalukku konja அவங்களுடைய கரியருக்கு ஹெல்ப்பாக இருக்கும் அண்ட் நீங்கள் பிஎஸ்சி கம்ப்யூட்டர் சயின்ஸு பிஇ பிஇ பிடெக் கம்ப்யூட்டர் சயின்ஸ் எல்லாம் படிக்கும்போது இன்ஃபர்மேஷன் டெக்னாலஜி படிக்கும்போது ஒவ்வொரு இன்ஜினியரிங் காலேஜ் கோர்ஸஸ்லேயும் ஃபஸ்ட் இயரில் வர்றது வந்து லாங்குவேஜ் ப்ரோக்ராம் வராமல் வராது சி ப்ரோக்ராமிங் இருக்கும் பைத்தான் இருக்கும் அதுவே நீங்கள் சிஎஸ்சி டிபார்ட்மெண்ட்டாக இருந்தீங்கன்னா கம்ப்யூட்டர் சயின்ஸ் இன்ஜினியரிங் டிபார்ட்மெண்ட்டாக இருந்தீங்கன்னா ப்ரோக்ராமிங் நாலேஜ் ரொம்ப ரொம்ப இம்பார்ட்டன்ட் அப்படின்றதுனால ரைட்டிங் ப்ரோக்ராம்ஸை நம்ம வந்து வச்சுருக்கோம் ஓகே so you just uh, share this uh, you share about you, you just share to your friends about this session and uh, your ungalukku uh, the session la romba pidichirukku nu nenikira ungalukku pidikala puriyala edha puriyala abadina you just send through comments send to mail id wellevelcalvi@gmail.com and i give you mobile number 9361828165 okay so uh, you just do it and thanks for watching and thanks for uh, attending the class Uh, we will see uh, tomorrow as usual sir seven that inshallah thank you Note it down the program.
We will note that. Okay, fine. So one uh, important uh, news is that that is called uh, that is BLK contest. Well, level can be one to uh, twelve standard one. I am only passing the cafe. Or contest one. Not that no. That is one drawing competition and uh, essay writing competition. Two names are there. And uh, th today is the last day for uh, sending all. So twelve o'clock full. இன்னைக்குமே அண்ட் அதை நீங்கள் வந்து வேர் லெவல் கல்வி அட் ஜிமெயில் டாட் காமுக்கு மட்டுமே நீங்கள் அனுப்பணும் இதுவரை யாரும் பார்ட்டிசிபேட் பண்ணலை அப்படின்னா நீங்கள் வந்து ட்ராயிங் பண்ணி இன்னைக்குள்ளே நீங்கள் வந்து பண்ணியிருக்கேன் அண்ட் ஒருவர் அதுக்கான ப்ரைஸஸ் வந்து ஜூலை ஃபர்ஸ்ட் வீக் அதில் வந்து உங்களுக்கு அனௌன்ஸ் பண்ணப்படும் ஜூலை ஃபர்ஸ்ட் வீக் அதான் இந்த இன்னைக்கு வந்து டுவெண்ட்டி ஃபைவ்க்குள்ளே நாங்கள் வந்து அதை பார்த்துருவோம் டுவெண்ட்டி ஒன் டூ டேஸ் த லாஸ்ட் டேட் அதனால் டுவெண்ட்டி ஃபைவ் தேர்ட்டிக்குள்ளே நாங்கள் வந்து அதை பார்த்து முடிச்சு எல்லாத்தையுமே ரெடி பண்ணிடுவோம் நீங்கள் பண்ண வேண்டிய ஒரு விஷயம் என்ன அப்படின்னா இன்றைக்கி பன்னிரெண்டு மணிக்குள்ளே நீங்கள் அனுப்பலை அப்படின்னா அனுப்பிடுங்க அதுக்கப்புறம் நான் உங்களுக்கு நான் நாங்கள் வந்து உங்களுக்கு கால் பண்ணி வெரிஃபை பண்ணுவோம் உங்களுடைய இது உங்களுடைய எஸ்ஐ தான் அப்படின்னு ஒரு வீடியோ எடுத்து காட்டு சொல்லுவோம் ஏதாவது கிராஸ் வெரிஃபிகேஷன் இருந்தால் கண்டிப்பாக அதை பண்ணுவோம் அதெல்லாம் அந்த டுவெண்ட்டி ஒன்லேருந்து தேர்ட்டிக்குள்ளே அது வந்து முடிஞ்சிடும் ஸோ ஜூலை ஃபர்ஸ்ட் வீக் வந்து அதுக்கான ரிசல்ட்டை வந்து உங்களுக்கு சொல்லுவோம் அண்ட் இந்த ப்ரோக்ராமில் யாரெல்லாம் பார்ட்டிசிபேட் பண்ணியிருக்கீங்களோ அவங்களுக்குலாம் மொமெண்டம் சர்டிஃபிகேட்டு அண்ட் தென் கேஷ் அவார்டு இது எல்லாமே இருக்குது இது எல்லாமே வந்து ஜூன் செகண்ட் வீக்கில் வந்து உங்களுடைய வீட்டுக்கு வரும் அதாவது கொரியருடைய சர்வீசஸ் இருந்துச்சுன்னா எவ்வளோ சீக்கிரமாக வர முடியுமோ அவ்வளோ சீக்கிரமாக அதெல்லாம் வந்துடும் அண்ட் ப்ரைஸிங் ப்ரைஸ் யாரெல்லாம் ரொம்ப பண்ணியிருக்கீங்க வின்னர்ஸ் அப்படின்றத வந்து நான் உங்கள் உங்களுக்கு சீக்கிரமாகவே உங்களுக்கு அதாவது ஜூலை ஃபர்ஸ்ட் வீக்கில் உங்களுக்கு சொல்லிடுவோம் அண்ட் நம்பர் த்ரீ இதில் ரொம்ப முக்கியமான விஷயம் என்ன அப்படின்னா கேஷ் அவார்டு இது எல்லாமே வந்து இதை பொறுத்த வரையும் எங்களுக்கு எவ்வளோ ஸ்பான்ஷிப் வருதோ அதுக்கு தகுந்த மாதிரி உங்களுக்கு வந்து கேஷ் அவார்டு மொமெண்டம் தான் இருக்கும் இதில் கண்டிப்பாக யாரெல்லாம் மெயில் அனுப்பியிருக்கீங்களோ அவங்க எல்லாருக்குமே பார்ட்டிசிபேஷன் சர்டிஃபிகேட் கண்டிப்பாக அவங்களுடைய வீடு தேடி வரும் அந்த சர்டிஃபிகேட் மேபி இ சர்டிஃபிகேட்டாக இருக்கலாம் இல்லைன்னா நான் சர்டிஃபிகேட் வந்து எங்களால் கொரியர் அனுப்ப முடியும் அப்படின்ற பட்சத்தில் கண்டிப்பாக நாங்கள் உங்களுக்கு கொரியர் அனுப்பிச்சு வைப்போம் இல்லைனா ஸ்பீட் போஸ்ட்டில் அனுப்பி வைப்போம் அப்படி எந்த ஒரு சுச்சுவேஷனும் இல்லாத பட்சத்தில் நாங்கள் வந்து என்ன பண்ணுவோம்னா இ சர்டிஃபிகேட்டாக அனுப்பி வைப்போம் மொமெண்டமை பொறுத்த வரையும் எங்களால் அனுப்பி வைக்க முடியலை அப்படின்னா லேட் ஆகுது அப்படின்னா எப்போ ரெகுலர் ப்ராசஸ் வருதோ போஸ்டில் எப்போ நார்மல் ப்ராசஸ்க்கு வருதோ அந்த டைமில் உங்களுக்கு ரீச் ஆகும் ஸோ அதனால் டுடே இஸ் த லாஸ்ட் டேட் ஒன் செகண்ட் ஐம் ஜஸ்ட் டெலிங் Today is the last date uh, to submit your writing essays and uh, your drawings. Once again, I am uh, giving the title uh, of Awareness of COVID. Be aware and aware of COVID-19, coronavirus. Be aware and be aware of COVID-19. That is the uh, title. Today is the last date. Okay. Well, thanks for watching. இதுவரையும் வரதா ஜெயிச்சு இதுவரையும் வரதா ஜெயிச்சு சொல்லுவாங்க அப்போ போங்க 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 போங்க